nilikuwa like a monster venye na fresh kwa tunaenda tunapata msia kwa anajifanya anaongea na simu venye kuna backup ya wasi wawili enda kani nimemshika na nimempin kidaga mimi ni wani jenge zangu ni jenge ni wanafa mjenge tuko tumeenda base flani uchai so tuko na bike na tuko na mmoja amejigard na mimi sasa so mimi nilikuwa naonekana kwa the view na jo kuongea naweza return wewe fikiria mimi mwizi so na kuja hapo kwa mpesa unafikiria na na bye ama nataka ni trade so ni hakuna wazena during night hours ndio usiweze kuonekana so na wewe baka uko na mamaska uko na hizo shirts so uko na pull up hivyo kwa mimi tumetuki helmet unatokea mjipin block so ninge kwa mpesa kama ume tachisha unaambia madam aka pesa yote kwa hiki banda na akifikiria ni jokes una una mconfirm ni kidungi una cock na lazani ukweli so nakumbuka aliniekea do kumbe madam anakonga maybe kwa mpesa sana sisi tulikuwa sana wale wasi nafaa tu serve as an example eh kwenda hapo hivyo mzee usiki amenekea do vizuri nakumbuka tukihesabu ilikuwa 175000 nimetokea kwa bag vizuri so mimi nikajengwa ujengwa au sasa kwa pen wanataka sasa wana ngoje nikalie alafu ndo tuende sisi nimeenda kupanda hivi pen mzee nikaslip nikaanguka wagwa and farm inakuwaje good morning good afternoon good evening good whatever time it is you're watching us welcome back to rada chapu my name is monene na kama kei kama kawa tumekaa mimi mtama mzee tafuta ma vijana hawa wamekoka crime aka reform weze ku educate wasi kunja that crime si pona crime ilipi so leo tuko privileged tuko privileged kwa na mgeni mmoja wa power sana kwa show na sitaki ku waste time leo usually itakuwa moja kali so yeah, yeah, yeah. bila kupoteza wakati tusikie story yake that's wago na wago nchampe ah uh, what's up nigga vipi vipi pretty jina ni nani wana kuitanga je mta uh, okay first and foremost mimi niko na majina ka tatu eh uh-huh. niko na nickname niko na real name na niko na nickname nyingine tena jinga okay so unaweza niita kadere yani nickname yajulikana hood mtani my real name ni dero ama deriko na bado naweza niita abash ten good okay yeye usanii sasa Uh, okay. Yeah. So bro tumekuwa tukisikia story yako. Uh-huh. Tukasema lazima leo tukilete kwa show. Tuweze kubanja na mafans. Yeah. Moja mbili story story of a life mazi. Yeah, yeah. Bile mlikom na mnachapa masina did time uli amo ku reform man. Yeah. So naweza tupeleka na rada. Okay. Way back in around 2010. I was still a youth. Kijana mdogo full of influence na esteem skibao so mimi nilikuwa kijana mwenye damu moto niko na do kiasi so i recall when i used to be a thug mimi kwa dingo nilikuwa na naimba masimu ninge kaje amse tunachafua tunakuacha bila shit ilikuwa tu mbaya like hata tume tumeza fanya kitu yetu kwa nataka kufanya vitu gani kenye nataka like for example because i do Maybe you had someone am um, um, stab because you want money you see so ilikuwa ni kitu tunafanya twice per week monday na friday Hei ilikuwa ni siku mbili yenye tuna meet na gang yangu tulikuwa mtu tatu tulikuwa tunafanya vitu za ujinga like mostly kuiba and every time i tell this story I feel like crying as it. Nilikuwa like a monster when I was in fresh. Kwa tunaenda tunapata msia kwa anajifanya anaongea na simu. Mimi niko na backup ya wasi wawili. Enda kani nimemshika na nimempin kidaga. Mimi ni wani jenge zangu. Ni jenge ni wanafa mjenge. So due to that fear ana ana ananipatia kila kitu hapa na hadi doko mpesa because anataka a maintain life yake. So we got my dear say like literally tunaiba maduka tunaiba mpesa because of money. Ile sinenye ilikuwa mbaya sana hadi 
karibu we fail tuko tumeenda base flani uchai so tuko na bike na tuko na mmoja ame guard na mimi sasa so mimi nilikuwa naonekana kwa the view na jo kuongea naweza return wezi fikiria mimi mwili so na kuja hapo kwa mpesa unafikiria na na buy ama nataka ni trade senya kuna zina during night hours ndio usiweze kuonekana so na wewe baka kuna ma mask kwa na wewe shirt so uko na pull up hivyo kwa mimi ndumetuki helmet unatokea umejipeni block so unaingia kwa mpesa kama ume tachisha unaambia huyu madam aka pesa yote kwa hii kibanda na akifikiria ni jokes una una mconfirm ni kidongi una cock anaonezani ukweli so nakumbuka aliniekea do umo madam anakonga mebe kwa mpesa sana hizi tulikuwa sana wale wasi tunafaa to serve as an example eh kwenda hapo hivyo mzee usiki amenekea do vizuri nakumbuka tukihesabu ilikuwa 175000 sasa mm-hmm. mtoke kwa bag vizuri so mimi nikajengwa ujengwa au sasa kwa pen wanataka sasa wanangoje nikalia alafu ndo tuende sinyi nimeenda kupanda hivi pen mzee nika sleep nikaanguka jo msia kulikuwa na poor timing ameamsha dudhi kasi ya kalia eh nikaanguka mzee alafu hapo kando tu ni stage ya dudhi msikii man wasio akakuja mzee mpaka nika mmoja akanirushia mawe kanigonga kwa mgongo tena nika anguka ili bidi hiyo glock nimechapisha ndio niweze kuhepa ube sikupiga mtu nilishud juu eh wasio akaogopa si nikapata hiyo chance ya kukalia pen kwenda ndio mimi naomba naomba nga Mungu man siku shikwa njivenye tukalio pe bado kuna nyole tufuata hawataki kujua kama tumejipin so ku shoot na siku anataka ni waste my bullets juu okay waste my bullets hiyo ni dogo bado so nika shoot uskili li li li, li waste almost three bullets like siku shoot mtu lakini gladly to help a vizuri so hiyo ni sisi nyenye ilipo almost ni kwa court I think hiyo ndo nifanya tena nika move into this big level ya ku aina mbaka kuibia wase kwa nyumba. So it was bad thing. Na that is one of the, my stories yenye nasemanga kama nilianza ku help na siku get murdered. Mungu wako. So mimi after ma, ma scenes zingine mingi tuliona kwa KJMC. Hizi uh-huh. zilikuwa Kumbuka ilikuwa 2011 mwezi wa pili Feb tarehe 14 na mbili. Leona tuka ibia one of our friends. Ndio tulikuwa sawa baya tutambua sio nyingine. One of our friends ali crew ni tunashikisha pamoja base. Omsi alikuwa na do. Alikuwa na assets. Alikuwa na good job. So si nyamenda job. Si tumepulo kijani tuna job yenye rada iko. Kakata ka badlo kuna kutumia axo juni penye anaishi hakuna wase like hiyo tip ilikuwa ni tip leo asiwatana lakini yeye yeah, alikuwa anatoka na job pia wase wanaenda na rudi so tulifanya monitoring ile time tumepulo hapo hivyo axo ni teke teke turns by turns na wase tukimwenya nakata kuna mwenye nakata kuna mwenye anaangalia na kuna mwenye anaangalia inti wase usiki si tumeingia hapo tumekata hiyo padimbi mbaya nikichoka na signal mwingine anakuja hivyo hivyo hadi tuka make it kukata ilikuwa solex kaingia kijani eh nina kwambia msi alikuwa na assets so kuna boys wangu bado wanafanya ngauba na alikuwa anajua rada zetu basi after tume clear keja vizuri tumeenda tukatoa ma vitu ma tv maufa kulikuwa kulikuwa bado kuna na mapet kuna ma sling tukachukua kila kitu usiki sasa kwenda kwa, kwa bed ulikuwa na kibox fulani. Hii box kama ya Esco. Unijua meka do hapo ndani. Fuck. Uangalie hivi hata hizo tukaachana na hizo vitu zingine zote. Tuli end up tumeacha hizo vitu zote msi hapo. Kachukua hiyo box kaenda nayo. Ilikuwa ni kitrunk kidogo hivi. Yameko bado padi. Tukaingia kwa uba tukitekeka tumesafisha. Sasa venye tumefika kwa site yetu penye tuna chill sasa penye tunaenda tunaangalia do ngapi how much tunagawana 
hiyo padi kwanza hata tuku kata padi tulikata hiyo hiyo box ya mabati mimi nakwambia kulikuwa na 1.5 hapo ndani mpaka nilikuwa na shindu msi ana savage cash akwambia hiyo sandu ili ilifanya kwanza niachane na story za zaga juu ni kama nilika lock alafu tena nilikuwa na girlfriend mwenye nimemjaza ball alikuwa anani insist niachane na story za hizi mzee kila saa nikikuja kijani leta na ngumetoa pedo mzee na huyu kwa job so alikuwa anataka niache kabisa story za wizi mimi nikaona yenyewe nimepenya hii deal na niko na do siri tu niende nianzishe biz yangu kwingine tuka move tuka shift tukaenda mtaingine pesa ni kwa hisab tukachukua keja tukafeel kila kitu ile mbogi hata sikuambie nikaenda mimi nisafisha kabaridi na nikakata connections nikaenda huko nikafungulia mama biz kibandaski ile kufisha tu wise mimi nikafungua biz ya jaba ndio biz ya jaba bado kuna kakinyuzi hivi so nika nika lima nika lima nika lima almost for 5 years up around 2015 2016 7 years 2017 kulikuwa sana mamori wangu fulani pia alikuwa ngala ni trace so naona niko na do uski ile sufficient do zote nakuja nikaibua kila kitu mama alikuwa shaza niko na junior mzee life imekuwa hard hata na concentrate on story ya familia ili sufficient kila kitu mzee hadi kwa nyenye nilikuwa nayo nienda so mimi kwenye naweza avoid kama my viewers man story story za za wizi i say did you mimi niliiba nikakuwa successful lakini at the end of the day zote zote zilisha nikarudi mtaa mpaka nikakuwa ile msisi sasa naomba please ya kudozi jaba sisi jishikia hizi ma, ma pleasure na mastery zangu nyingi nilikuwa nataka na nafikiria na kufanya singeza kufanya mission yangu ya kutaka kusema my family tuende ni kwa a good father have a good family ilipotea hivyo dema lisafisha aliona saa mimi nimekuwa mlaini ah nimekuwa kwa street mzee nimehangaika kuna siku nikajaribu kuiba i could go through ni kwa nini ujinga na nilikuwa nime je hapa tena sitaiba nimeona mamori wangu bado akiangushwa yani a story for another day so to sum up mimi naza inform my boys wote nyoko kwenje it's better kwenda unyenyeke kwa msitu umwambie mazivi nyoko hali mbaya akusaidia venye anaweza kukusaidia instead wende uchachishe huko nje maybe ilikuwa ni siku yako umado mimi nimeponea info mara kibao so mimi na encourage mzee to story za uvaga na uwezi ban for reform the form mimi ni reform sai because ili get help me right now sai niko na 3 years from reforming ada is bro tumeshukuru sana kwa kubali kama kwa show yetu mzee na ndivyo tumekupata na haraka tutakuleta tena kwa part 2 Yeah. Yo, umesema, sure kuna part two, umesema kuna part three na part four. Umesema kuna story moto sana. Eh uh, sasa ndaambia venye sasa <laughs> procedure yote, <laughs> venye kunikuwa, venye kunifanya mpaka nika reform. So, so this is just introduction. Okay. Let us get to know each other. Kweli kweli. Nice nice pow pow. Eh uh, others uh, wait pow pow. Ndio sasa. Others thank you so much bro kwa for coming through kwa issue yetu. Tuna hope tutapatana for the part 2. To all of us thank you so much for continuing to support our content by subscribing, liking na sharing na tunaoi tutaendelea kuwaletea more and more and more interesting topic. If you're watching us for the first time, hit the subscription button mzee na tutashukuru sana. Till we meet next time. Together. Bye bye. Asafi. <laughs>